Hi friends, welcome or welcome back to Spooktober. Today we are watching Tucker and Dale versus Evil. Can you even hear me? It is freezing in Norway and the snow hasn't even fallen yet. So I'm here with the blanket and PJs. That is the vibe we're going for this entire October, I believe. Anyways, I have no idea what this movie is about. It was a favorite on the Patreon poll. It even won one of the polls. So, um, I believe this is the shortest movie I've seen in a while. It is about one hour and 20-ish minutes long. Anyways, if you didn't know, we are so close to hitting 40,000 subs. So if you haven't already, you should totally subscribe to the channel. Even give it a thumbs up if you enjoy the content. If you'd like to watch my full reaction, it's over on Patreon. And if you'd like to connect, you can find me on all my social media. They will all be linked down below. Thank you so much for clicking into the video and spending time with me. And let's go watching Tucker and Dale vs. Evil. Are you sure we should be doing this? This is still a crime scene. Sack up, Billy. It's called investigative journalism for a reason. Yeah, but don't we need like a press pass or a permit or something? Press pass this! You know, the police missed something here. I can feel it. What do you say, Billy? Won't a Peabody Award look great up on your... <coughs> oh! 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 We're starting straight at it. Yeah, guys, see, this is my dad's car. So if I go any faster, he will kill me. Oh, shit! Shit! Jesus, that was close. You fucking assholes! We are in Hillbilly Country now, boys. You're either Omega Beta or you're a freak. Omega Beta! Omega Beta! Omega Beta! Omega Beta! I'm in a car full of morons. No, if we were morons, we wouldn't have thought to bring this. Okay, I, I stand corrected. You are a fucking genius. Hey! Did you see the way those guys looked at us? We forgot the beer. No! <laughs> oh my god. You can't forget the beer if you're going out of town. Can I help you? Where's your beer at? The beer's in the back. Why is everyone so strange? You see the way them kids look? Hey, Chad, do we need more bucks? Chad? It's just me. Oh my god, I jumped. <laughs> this place is so creepy. Yeah, but you're missing a guy. Yeah, we need anything else. Pickled eggs, six pounder. Okay, that's stale. Oh, hot dog, Tucker. Have you ever seen anything like that in your life? This is your average college girls. Nothing average about that. She's just human. Why don't you go over there and talk to her? Talk to her? What? What in the world would I say? Tell her that you got a vacation home. That'll probably impress her. These are college girls, okay? They grew up with vacation homes and guys like me fixing their toilets. Aww. Girls can smell fear. Now, come on. You are a good-looking man. More or less. You got a damn good heart. Yep. I mean, that's two things right there. <laughs> now, go on. Get over there. Whatever you say, just smile and laugh. That shows confidence. Smile and laugh. Okay. Why is he walking with the giant? Oh boy. Grim the Reaper. You guys, uh, going camping? <laughs> so just oh, help back. Oh, okay, off. Oh, oh, okay, back okay, off. okay. I'm sorry. Get in the truck. I told you, Tucker. I'm a zero with the ladies. I hate my face. <laughs> He's so cute. I can't, I can't talk to the lady folk the way you can. I always get all stupid. My hands get clammy, and I just I act like a big fat idiot. Gonna just fall right in your lap. That's true, I reckon. Oh shit! What are you doing? Shit! 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 shit. Huh? We got a cop. Oh, I got you. Stink you all over the crotch. All right, he's pulling over. No, it's stuck on my sleeve. Get up. My hand is stuck on his car. He's out of his car. He's out of his car. He's coming. Oh, Joker. Plastics, please. Okay. 
Lost my wallet a couple weeks back. New one is in the mail. Temporary. We are headed to our vacation home up by Morris Lake. I sank every penny I had into it. Me and Dale here, we're going to go fix her up. Maybe do a little fishing. Do a little fishing. He's been striking out with the ladies. I figure a little man time might do him some good. There ain't nothing up there but pain and suffering on a scale you can't even imagine. I pulled you over because you got a broken turn signal. Oh, yes, sir. See that you uh, get that fixed. That well, was very helpful. Everyone is freaking me out. And that's weird. There he goes. Bye. God, you look at him. You know what his problem is? He was jealous because he can't afford a place of his own. Oh my God. It's yep. perfect. Oh. All right, let's go check it out inside. Yeah. I can't believe this is ours. Oh my God. <laughs> it's just a little dusty, is all. It's a mansion. Uh-oh. An archaeologist or something. Look at this. Must have been a real news junkie, too. Chubby's Chili Dog Depot. Buy three, get two free, no expiration date. All right. Score. They got my favorite board game here, too. I'll tell you something, Dale. I cannot believe that I am standing in my own vacation home right now. Dreams really do come true. Oh, oh look out! Well, I guess we should fix that. Yeah, that's a good idea. You can get off of me now. Okay, so if you have a reoccurring dream about sucking a dick, but you never do it, are you gay? Yes. Yes. Right. And you fuckers want to hear a real story? This story happened right here, right in these very woods. It was 20 years ago today. The Memorial Day Massacre. Hey, man, what the hell are you doing? Yeah, put that back on. No, 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 this is cool. This is cool. I like this. And only one person lived to tell this story. The rest of them just disappeared. And their bodies are buried beneath us. There's a lake back there. Who wants to go skinny dipping? I do. <laughs> I'm not getting Let's naked. Get okay, went from horror story to skinny dipping. You take that, that's yours. See, that's why you're never gonna get ahead in life. That's because you don't stick up for yourself. Do Ow. not even think about it. What you just said. Are you kidding me? Ow. Are you serious? I said I gotta stick up for myself. I said don't even think about it though, so that was the last thing I said. Oh. oh. Someone there? Guys. Ah! God, Chad, what the hell are you doing? You know, you can drop the act now. Like you're better than everyone else. I don't think. Yeah, you do. But that's okay. Only because I get it. I mean, you are better than everyone else. What the hell? I'm glad that we have this chance to get to know each other better. You're That's a good thing. It lowers my inhibitions. Okay, okay. Uh, come on, stop. Why? We're perfect for each other. Come on, Allie, come on. Hey, I, my guess would be that they don't really want to see us right now. Yeah. It, it, no, I kind of want to see them. What the hell are you doing? Damn it, Dave. What? I'm not going to go around one more time with you on this. <laughs> Hush. Oh, they're so creepy. Oh. He's covering his eyes. Tucker! Shush! Ah! Ah! God damn it, Dale, what the hell is the matter with you? Me? What did I do? When you see a college girl prancing around in front of you half naked, you do not yell out my name. Well, you were being a peeping Tom. Uh, guys, she got hit? She didn't come up yet. Uh, uh, no, you're in the boat. Uh, come on. Ah, we got your friend! Oh god! We got Allison! Oh my god! These guys! We got your friend! Why the hell are they running away? Hey! No matter, Tucker, we gotta get her back to the cabin. Come on! The hillbillies! Come on, hillbillies! Hillbillies from the store! They captured Allison! <laughs> Don't, don't, don't cry. Please don't cry for you. It's the pancakes. You hate pancakes. I'm, I'm gonna make you something else. Be fist, you idiot.
<laughs> he is so adorable. I can't help it. Well, it was really dark, but it looked like one of the guys was eating her face off. That is so disgusting. So stupid. Oh, he found it. Hey, guys. You better come look at this. What is this place? It doesn't mean they're psycho killers. Then why don't you go in there and talk to them? Maybe I will. <laughs> I said maybe. Please don't tell me that you hate eggs and bacon. What am I doing here? Oh, you don't, you don't remember? Okay, uh, Tucker and I brung you here last night. But because you were about to go swimming with your friends and then you climbed up onto a bunch of rocks and you slipped and fell and banged your head and then you fell into the water and then I dove in and rescued you. Wait, you... No, 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 the worm's fine, no. I swear to God, no, no, we were out there fishing. I didn't, I didn't see, maybe Tucker might have seen a little... Where are my friends? They ran off into the woods. They, they, they just left. They? And that's why Tucker and I brung you here, hoping that they would come and get you in the morning. I didn't, I didn't have any... No. You should relax and rest, okay? What's your name? Uh, it's Dale. Ducker. So my name, my name is Dale. I'm Allison, but my, 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 my friends call me Allie. Well, it's a real pleasure to meet you, Allie, son. And if you need anything else, you just holler for me. I'll be right in the little room here. Uh, Dale? Yeah? Do you guys have anything to, to do around here? Do you like board games? What kind do you have? <gasps> Here's my favorite. Trivia up. <laughs> Come on, four to seven. No way, dude. You lost. Oh, but they are so sweet, though. Damn Romeo. Of course. Come on, be alive! Yeah! <laughs> oh, they're making everything worse. Here we go. Big roll. Five. Got this weird brain where I'm dumb as a stump, but I remember everything that I ever heard. Sounds pretty smart to me. What is it that you study in college? I'm getting my bachelor's degree in psychology. Oh, that, uh, th oh. I just think that so many of the major problems and conflicts in the world are caused by a lack of communication, you know? I just always thought that I'd, I'd make a really good therapist. No, don't, don't! That beam is a little bit rickety. Hey, hey. Oh, my God. Oh boy. I saw it into a bee's nest. Why? Well, I didn't do it on purpose, you idiot. And I might have avoided if you were out there helping me. We came out here to work. No, it's in the right place, stupid board games. It was, it was my fault. It was my fault. Hey, how about I come over there and I pull those stingers out of your face and then I'll help you with whatever you want. All right, I'd like that, thank you. Okay. Let me help. Wow, they really did a number on you. Be careful, be careful. I really got you. I saw your friend out there. He must be allergic to bees or something because he was running like a bat out of hell. You need to rest. So we'll go find your friends. But oh, great idea. We'll, we'll go find your friends. You should relax. Tucker and Dale are on the case. Ain't that right, Tucker? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Dale, just, just be careful, okay? I, my friends can be kind of judgmental. I know. They fucking killed him, man. They left his body here as a message. Yeah. Stay the fuck out of our woods. Fucking quit it with this thing, okay? It doesn't work out here. <clears throat> we gotta get to the road and try to catch right out of here. Survival of the fittest. <laughs> what are you doing, man? That's my whole face. You have serious issues, you know that? College girl like that, and I was beating the crap out of her. Well, I'll tell you what. When we get back, I'll finish her off real quick, and then we'll get back to work, okay? They're gonna kill her. Somebody was just here. Oh, yeah. Don't you see a dead body soon? College oh. kids! <gasps> college kids! Say it again. Louder. College kids! Hey, college kids! College kids! I don't know. They must have run off. Maybe we could leave them a note in case they come back. Right, with what? Well, this will work. All right, please, hurry up. My okay. face is as hot as a hemorrhoid right now. Yeah, you don't look so good. Be careful. I'm going to have to etch it in. Friend wrong. 
Does everybody have their weapons? Yes, sir. You guys go around, get the guy at the wood chipper, and take the big guy. I'm gonna just chill right here. They're going to kill Dale? Oh, good look, your friends are here! Hey! Oh my god. Are you okay? Uh, what? <laughs> Tucker! Tucker! You never What happened to you? Are you okay? What happened to me? Some kid. He just hooked himself right into the wood chipper. What? Head first right into the wood chipper. From his shoes and his pants, it looked like it might have been one of the college kids. What the hell happened to her? What? Oh, uh, she got knocked down, fell into a shitter hole right next to me. It's your blood? What? No. No, it's college kid blood. One of those suckers came running out of nowhere and speared himself straight through the gut and died right on top of me, Todd. Calm down. Calm down. Don't cry. Calm down. Okay. Get a hold of yourself. <sighs> All right. Oh, no. I know what this is. What? This is a suicide pact. These kids are coming out here and they're killing themselves all over the woods. Oh my god, that makes so much sense. Holy shit, we have got to hide all of the sharp objects. I think they're trying to kill her too. Think about it, that's why they acted so funny after we saved her, because they want her dead. Why? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it's good that you don't know. It's good that I don't know, because if we knew, then they would want to kill us too. They want to kill you. We go to the police? Tell them what? Oh, I oh, would oh, tell them what happened. That's a good idea, Dale. We've had a doozy of a day. There we were minding our own business, just doing some chores around the house when kids started killing themselves all over my property. Well, that's what happened, Tucker. You would have to be a moron to believe that, Dale. It doesn't matter what happened. What matters is what looks like what happened. And what looks like what happened is pretty nasty. So what the hell do we do then? We gotta clean this mess up right now. <laughs> Shouldn't be smoking anyway, Chloe. It's not good for you. Yeah, well, fucking dying isn't good for you either, but that seem to be stopping anybody. What the hell are you still doing here? How are we gonna get out of here? 40 miles? Maybe you should have thought of that before you wore your stripper shoes. Okay, we gotta just shut up. Oh, this movie. I mean, whose stupid idea was this? Chad. You guys are all a bunch of fucking pussies. I hate this guy. I mean, a few little <clears throat> tiny murders and everyone just freaks out. How many people do you think get a chance for something like this? The chance to die? The chance to live. To be free from people always telling you what you can and can't do. And if you don't think you can handle that, maybe you deserve to die. <gasps> That's fucked up. <laughs> yeah. Check out the police. Oh my God, come on, you guys, let's go. The cops aren't gonna help us, man. What, don't you fucking idiots know anything? Oh God! Help us! Help us! Help Slow down now. <laughs> Okay, stay calm. Why don't you kids climb in the back seat and we'll go have a look. Those stupid fucks. Ew. Oh, damn, and they're pretty good. Wedge it from that side and you pull them out uh, on three. Okay. Right? Yep. Oh, take it off! Take it off me! Take it off me! Get off me! Get off me. <laughs> Here, grab a leg. Grab a leg. Get him over the truck. We have had a doozy of a day. A real doozy. When all of a sudden, out of nowhere, these kids started killing themselves all over my property. Yeah, this one right here. He dove head first right into the wood chipper. Now, I don't know how much experience you've had with this, but we were scared shitless. Scared shitless. I you must think that I'm some kind of moron to believe a story like that. Not a moron, Not just open-minded. Oh my god. I think maybe they might be trying to kill the girl that we have inside. She can maybe explain the whole thing. If 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 uh if I hadn't knocked her unconscious with a shovel <laughs> on accident. On accident. You've got another one inside and and you say she's unconscious? Yeah, she's in my bedroom. <laughs> Why you keep talking? Well, you better show me what you done with her. Wait, 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 where's he going? What's he doing? Why doesn't he fucking arrest them? Rise are equal. React to the light. I told you boys to stay away from this place, but you just didn't listen, did you? Officer, do we look like a couple a psycho killers to you? Yeah. <laughs> Looks can be deceiving. Oh, no, no! Ah!
I thought they said they were gonna fix it. Go walk it off. He's gonna be fine. Oh, oh, damn it! Oh, Tell her I told you we shouldn't fix that thing. Oh, 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 oh. Heads up. The fuck you, you motherfuckers. No, no, no. Oh, we gotta take the safety off on the side there. Don't do it. Oh. Samaritan. Oh my god, she's drowning, Tucker. Oh, let's save her. Oh, let's save her. At least she's still alive. Oh, holla fucking Louie. <laughs> don't you dare blame us on her. None of this would have happened if we hadn't have gone fishing. I don't even like fishing. You don't like... What do you mean you don't like fishing? Uh, uh... Aww. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Tucker. Did I hurt your feelings? Yeah, you kind of did. Oh. Hey, Hillbill, uh, your move. Think up my dog. I ain't never shot at nobody before. If it helps, Think of them like moving two by fours. Oh! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm gonna go out the back door. Okay. And Dale? Yeah. Try not to shoot me. Okay, I'll try. All right. Hey, college kids! You want some of this? He needs to save the dog. Oh, you like that, college kids? How's that taste? I got plenty more where that came from. Bunch of freaks. Not the screaming. <laughs> if you kill my dog, I swear to God, I swear to God, I'll get really mad. Aww. I'm gonna shoot your dog. I'm gonna get really mad. <laughs> it is a beautiful day for a run, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, oh God, please, no. Oh, Chad, you absolute. Oh, oh wait, he's alive. What the hell is wrong with you kids? I've never stood so close to pure evil before. It kind of stinks. I was supposed to be 24 hour protection. I can't. Oh, okay, don't, don't. I know you kids are having fun, but I am not a thrill seeker. Payback time, hillbilly. This is for Mike. No! That is ah! Ah! I can't. I can't really say. Uh, it was so awful. Oh, oh, oh God! I'm embarrassed. I'm sorry. It's, it's, it's good to, to cry sometimes. It's hard to say. Your friends. Do some of your friends take medication? Because I think they forgot to take it. Where are they? They're out there somewhere right now trying to kill my best friend and my dog. Wait, I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. That's what the truth is. I mean, it's like all your friends just decided to go nuts all at the same time. Todd was was running at us. Yeah, first I thought they were trying to kill you. And then they started killing themselves. And then they tried to kill us. And now they're going after my dog. My my friends would never hurt anyone. Oh, look at Jesus. There you Nobody wants to hurt you. Die, that sure sounds like someone does. No, no, Allison, don't go out there. Oh. Allison! That's from Tucker's shirt. What is that? Oh my god. Oh, oh my god! god! They cut off his bowling fingers! His bowling fingers? There's a note. There's a note right there. Now we got your friend. Try and get him. They must have thought that you were trying to harm me. And why would they think that? When we first saw you guys back back at that store, we just thought that, that you looked a, a, a little creepy. I was nervous. I, I don't know how to talk to girls. And I... No, Dale, I, I, I know that now, but we didn't then. You thought that I looked like some kind of freak. I should have known that if a guy like me talked to a girl like you, somebody would end up dead. Oh my god. It's, it's, not, it's not like that. If you do see your friends, tell them that I never wanted to hurt anybody. Dale, Dale, stop, wait. Don't go there. Oh, shit. Tucker Harris is trapped. Oh, no, oh, no, Chuck, no. I don't want that, I don't want that, please. Oh, God. Tucker. Dale. I never thought I'd say this, but I'm glad I'm not home like a bear. Oh, my God. That kid has got some serious issues. Wait. No. Oh. This vacation sucks. Let's just hope that Allison's still alive. Allison. What are you guys doing? We're saving you stupid new. Come on, let's go. Why are you whispering? There's there's no one else here. You can't do this. This is their vacation home. Tucker and Dale did not mean to hurt anyone. They're they're really nice. You have no idea. Oh my god. These freaks are evil and they deserve everything that's coming to them. They started this! 
Doing what? Saving my life? I remember reading about this in my sociology class. It's called the Stockholm Syndrome. Oh my god! Falling in love with their kidnapper. You're falling in love with him? You're not falling in love with that freak, Allison. <gasps> right now, this movie is frustrating. <laughs> are you, or are you not, in love with him? Tell me! <gasps> hey! Let the girl go. Chef. You okay, Allie? Did he just call you Allie? Wait, wait. Okay, Chad, you sit here, okay? Dale, you... You, you sit in this one. It's just pouring beer on his fingers. Or where they were. Yeah. I want you each to tell your side of the story. As you're listening to the other person, I want you to see yourself in their shoes. Oh my god, this whole therapy session. A long time ago, before I was born. Okay, maybe not that far. Back. This is important. You see, my parents, they were attacked by hillbillies just like him. It was 20 years ago, the Memorial Day Massacre. <laughs> my mother ran for her life, but they captured her. <laughs> my father was helpless, and he didn't even know that she was pregnant with me yet. And they forced him to watch while they tortured her. <laughs> but my mom, she fought back, and she escaped. But my father wasn't so lucky. His body was never found. By the time I was born, my mother was already institutionalized. I grew up hearing that story from my grandmother. Thank, thank you for sharing with us, Chad. Here they are, okay. Oh. They were gone longer than 50 minutes. We come in guns blazing. You don't even have a gun. Damn it, woman. Don't argue with me. Are they drinking tea? I would totally love a cup of tea right now. They're fucking trapped. I'm really sorry that your family got massacred. That is awful. Secondly, I didn't have anything to do with that. I can't even hurt a fish, can I, Tucker? I, I can't even hurt fish. That's right. You can't even hurt a fish. It's showtime, freaks! Go back to hell where you belong, freak. Oh no! I knew I should have moved that. Ellie, get out of here! My cabin. I'm a terrible therapist. What? No, no. That's not true. Don't say that. I thought you did a great job in there. Yeah, really. Maybe we should help him. Ah! Ah! Ne never mind, let's go! <laughs> they gotta go! Crazy college kid can't catch us now! Dude, huh? Oh boy. Nothing is going well. You took her. I tried to stop him. It's gonna be a long time before I take a vacation again. Oh, shit. Tucker, this is all my fault. Understandable. I remember you used to let me lick them all, too. That always made me feel kind of funny. Yeah. <laughs> but the thing is, I didn't let you catch more. You caught them on your own. You see, you're better than you think you are. Who knows, maybe after this is all done, you two can <laughs> uh, date <laughs> so, I doubt it. She needs you now more than ever. Especially because she always falling down and hitting her head, knocking herself out. True. Oh, Jesus! Oh, God. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, that hurt very much. I could tell. Oh, my Just God. Breathe in. Pick the shit out of that little college dickhead for me, would you? Just stay here, okay? Come on, James. Let's go. As he should. What is the matter with you? What, what is the matter with me? Do you have any idea what I've been through trying to save you? You've gone hillbilly on me, Allison. That was just not a very nice apology kiss, so you have to be more passionate than that. I've only just begun. What is wrong with him?
Why does people lick each other in the movies I'm watching? First Braveheart, now this. You want a killer hillbilly? I'll show you a killer hillbilly. Ah! Ah! Ellie, Ellie, hey, it's just me, hey. What are you wearing? What? Oh, I thought it might look kind of intimidating. Does it? Yeah. Sweet. Billy's so cute. You, you want to help me here? Oh, yeah. Hang on, I'm coming. Uh, hang on. How sweet. Dim-witted hillbilly is trying to save the girl of his dreams. It's time to say goodbye to the girl. You shouldn't have betrayed me, Allison. Okay, oh, hold on, hold on. Okay, Rabbit comes into the train. Rabbit goes around the train. Oh, come on! Okay! Allison doesn't have much time. Bring it, frat bitch. That kid is tough as nails. <laughs> oh, hey. This might work, huh? <laughs> or not. Oh, no. Fuck. What? Something look familiar? Get the guy in the middle. Oh, yeah. He looks just like that Kentucky Fried College kid down there. Single survivor leads police to the Memorial Day killer. Survivor is reported to have been tortured and raped. She's now undergoing psychiatric evaluation. I think we just found him. <laughs> Time to die, freak! Are you going to? No, 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 it's true, Chad. You have feel Billy. Everything is alive. It's the ingredient in chamomile tea that can cause an anaphylactic reaction in rare cases where people are allergic to it. Like I said, I remember weird stuff. But he'll be okay as long as we get him his inhaler. Oh! Or not. No okay. cap. <laughs> the chaos and confusion of what transpired here last night is still being unraveled. What appears to be a tragic mass suicide involving a group of mentally unstable college kids may in fact be the work of a lone deranged killer whose body is yet to be Knock, knock. Hey. Hey, buddy, how you feeling? I'm feeling high on prescription medication. <laughs> they found my fingers. Check it out. I don't remember that one looking that way. Mm -mm. No, no, not really. It, that looks natural. It's good. Pretty. Did you ask her out for God's sake? I was gonna, but then uh, I never actually got the chance so Dale you are hopeless you know that you're hopeless she kind of mentioned to me that she's a pretty darn good bowler so we're going bowling <laughs> you little dickhead I'm out of here <laughs> that is so good life is short BJ you have to go after what you want because it sure as heck fire ain't just gonna fall right into your lap. You know something you're right. I know. I'm gonna go talk to her. Okay. I'm pretty good at this, aren't you I? Are, that was great. <laughs> I hope you don't think this is too stupid or whatever, but. It's a helmet. It's a big helmet. <laughs> I think, you know, it might just be better if you wear that every day from now on. So. Okay, thank okay. you. I enjoyed every minute that I got to spend with you. If we're ever gonna get to spend this kind of time together again, and I just wanted to let you know that. I I feel the same way. Yay, Dale! BJ! Should we go help her? Hell no. Oh, how fun was this? Oh, this was so much fun! <laughs> wow, how fun was this? I really... Really, really enjoyed this. This was so much fun. This was not like the regular horror movies that I enjoy watching, but this was a comedy horror movie and I loved it. <laughs> Tucker and Dale vs. Evil was so much fun. Also very frustrating, but I also understand why it was made in the way it was. So it's not in a negative way that I was frustrated because 
I bet it was made that way to frustrate the viewers. <laughs> made me laugh so much and it also had made me roll my eyes a couple of times. I believe this is a movie that people should be watching and it might not be for everyone, but it was absolutely a movie for me. <laughs> I had so much fun. If you would like to watch the movie together with me, with my full reaction, it will be over on Patreon. And if you'd like to connect, you can find me on all my social media, link down below. I would absolutely, 10 out of 10, watch this movie again next season. You guys are really on the roll with the Patreon picks. So I'm excited to see what I think of the other movies that has won the polls. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for watching. I wish you a wonderful rest of the day. And I hope to see you in my next video very, very soon. Bye, guys.